DJ George. I've been DJing for about six years now. The way I started DJing was back in high school, I had my own online podcast and I wanted to incorporate some new things and to make it more interesting. So I just picked up a controller and just self-taught myself. YouTube was a, a good friend of mine. And from there, it's been history. Some nightclubs are DJ that here in Palm Beach, you know, all, all that Clematis, Clematis Social, Mango Cantina, Myers, Roxy's, even um, down south, all in the Winwood area, as well as um, out of state, DJ um, a couple clubs out of state. And the coolest place I've DJ that probably have to say, you know, one of the cruise ships is real cool, you know, seeing people from all around the world dancing to your, your music in the middle of the ocean. Real cool experience. So I'm seeing probably all uh, real high energy and energetic, you know, just want to get the crowd hype and interact with them, of course. Uh, so if I had nobody on the dance floor, you know, just use those mic skills to my best ability, you know, get them to the dance floor. And I have some of those songs in my back pocket that, you know, usually mostly always work. But if not, you know, you know, you just use the mic and interact with the crowd and get them going. I DJ about, I have to say, over 100 weddings for sure. And to accommodate, you know, for everyone, for the crowd, always want to make everybody happy. In the beginning of the night, you know, I play more open wide for everyone to enjoy good dancing music, you know, with the families and families. After, you know, as the night goes on, gravitate more to the bride and groom and to the liking, more party and hype, you know, fun music.